kind of a hard defense map, so we'll see how this goes. We got Betray, Esports attacking first against Fide. Fide is on defense. Looks like uh, they are going to ban the Yang. Fide Esports. Let's see who Betray bans. Um, I sense it's going to be a hard bridge. Like, there's so much walls that you can open on this this map. Or a black beer, or a glass. Yep, we are going to see a hard breacher be blown. Thermite is gone. Let's see what we got here for defense. Let's see who betray bans here. I am going to sense a lesion. Lesion, lesion, lesion. Oh, Mira. She's only really good on, like, one site. Ah, hookah, never mind. She's, she's pretty good on this map, actually. And I guess you could put her in kitchen too, but she's not like it's not like you're losing much when she's not around. Probably Ella Shotgun. Yep, Fide hates that Ella Shotgun. I believe this is Fide's best map, coastline. And we did see a sub done by Betray Esports. We got I May Rush playing. A very good fragger. So we got the Maestro, the Doc, the Bandit, the Vigil, and the Jaeger. No six, one six pick was done. They six picked up the Sophia to the Jackal. Alrighty, so we're gonna see a penthouse hold first. Usually the go-to spot. Or never mind, kitchen, sorry. <laughs> kitchen is the first hold. Uh, I wonder if they're gonna have a strong roam game top floor. You would expect them to. Virus is gonna rock that bandit iron sight, as most players tend to like it. Little nice glacier camo on that uh, little gold cup we got there. What is that, like a go for charm? Yeah, that is a go for charm. They're gonna take a service entrance hold here. They do have that nomad. Starting shot drone. I'm curious on what kind of a uh, tax side push they're gonna do here. Probably taking full of sunrise here. Ash looks like Ash is on the kitchen window. We got two pushing sunrise. Ooh, Ash takes a couple shots. Oh, Warfighter picks off Snake Killer. Down goes the Jaeger. 5v4 here. Lots of time left. Two minutes on the clock. There is one in Sunrise. It is the Maestro, I believe. He sees the Vigil. Black sees the Vigil. The vigil does have to move. Miller picks off Beastly. Down goes the Twitch. Black trades a lot of shots there. Vigil is still 100 health. Oh, down goes Balake. 3v4 situation here. We, well, 3v3. My show is literally one health. Byrise takes off May Rush. Down goes Ash. Bennett knows there's another one outside the blue window. They're flashing. One outside kitchen window. One outside blue window. The uh, the Nomad and the Habana are still alive. We got four left. 4v2 situation. Warpider does push into Sunrise. Sees the dock. Can we trade him out? Nope. Doc picks him off a bit. Oh wow, Doc is very low. Killer Miller picks off Warfighter. 4v1. Doc is very low. 1v3. Buy rise is down. We have a 3v1 situation here. The Doc, the Maestro, and the Vigil are still alive. Nomad sees the Vigil. 
Oh, Doc comes pushes out. Well pinched by the defense there. Played that very smart. So fight is up. One nothing. See what we're gonna get here. I'm gonna see a penthouse theater hold. Wonder if we're gonna see a castle come out. Thermite is banned, so there's not much they can uh, do about that wall unless they grab that Habana. But Blackbeard isn't banned. I don't know why they're not taking advantage of that Blackbeard sitting on the window. And the glass, I guess. That works. Got the Kai, the Dock, the Bandit, the Vigil, and the Jaeger. Yeah, I wonder if we're going to see Betray come alive here in this uh, second map here. Be nice to see that for sure. And we did it see, um, I believe it was Repoxel and Snake Killer who had 25 kills combined, I believe. Last map, I'm not 100% sure, but I believe it was 25 kills combined. Let's see if they could do that again, because that was well done, like they just fragged hard. Activated device. AD is active in this sector. Okay. Bob's wire set. Mm-hmm. So Sorry, just one second here, guys. Oh wow, Say Killer gets a spawn peek off the ash. Well done. Well done. So, with Fide, they just, they're so hard to predict. Ooh, Repuxel picks off that Twitch. I don't know how the Twitch did not see him coming. That is crazy. The here. Glass is on the roof. We got two people on the roof actually, and <laughs> the warfighter does flash himself. That was not a well done play there. Three v four situation here. Buck does get in that one spot. I don't think he realizes that he needs to actually get up on the roof and do the one thing. There is Killer Miller picks him off 2v4 situation here. Well done by the doc holding that tight angle from theater looking into Hall of Fame. By rise picks off rush 1v4 situation here. The Habana does have to frag out for looks like we're oh wow gets Killer Miller down it. And apparently no shots registered because Warfighter took no damage. And the Jaeger takes by rise is down. Warfighter picks off that Jaeger. He is pretty low. One is on theater side, holding the angle. Echo versus the Habana here. The Vigil is still roaming as the Vigil is for Puxel. Puxel is below him. He needs to frag that off that Echo or he's gonna have some issues due to that plant denial. Use the Echo's feet. Shoots the Echo. Echo is down. Wow. 1v1 situation here. Repuxel versus Nabana. Both pretty low, but Repuxel has the health advantage. Well done by Repuxel there, picking off the Habana at the end there. Fight is up to nothing.
So we are going to see a hookah hold. There is no mirror, so those uh, cool vibe stairs are going to be tough to hold. We've got a mute castle dock and a Jaeger. We see a captail coming into place, so I wonder if they're going to do a hookah plant. That'd be pretty interesting to see for sure. Betray is playing like a bunch of dead fish, they're just flopping. No energy. If we could pop up the scoreboard here, let's see how many kills they have in total. Yeah, they only have six kills in total right now. They're just not playing alive. They look they look beaten. They look tired and they look beaten. Looks like they've just been whacked around a couple times as you can see Snake Killer takes out Wiener. Wiener takes out Wiener Schnitzel. Actually, he's a pretty good player, he just doesn't play as much as he used to. Oh, the Locke picks off Snake Killer, 4v4 now, well done by the Locke. Here, the fauna is peeking the hookah window. Loading new magazine. Loading mag. Warfighter picks off a busy. Down goes a busy. Havana sees the dog. Well done by Warfighter. 4v2 now. Two defenders left, four attackers. We got the kite and the castle left. Havana pushes into sight. He does not see the kite, has no idea where he's returning shots from. Kai does have that powerful shotgun, so one of those bullets will kill that Havana easily. Plant is going down. You see somebody on cool vibe. Ooh, crouch spamming. Takes off the Havana. Sees the Ash. Takes off the Ash. Well done by Repuxel. You just gotta deal with this Jackal. By Rise. Wow, 2v1 situation here. This was a 2v5. Oh my goodness. I can't believe that just happened. Are we watching the same? We're team kills by Rise just to get that defuse. Wow. I can't believe that just happened. They just threw a 4v2. Wow. That was insane. Oh my goodness. My heart is racing for them. That was intense. Well done. Wow, I'm still in, like, what the fuck just happened? I <laughs> need team kills by Rise just to get that defused. That is hilarious. Wow. That's crazy. That is crazy. Look at that. Warfighter. Just... He's gonna need a bigger backpack because they're down three rounds. He is going to need a freaking school bus to carry his team right now. They are not playing up to par. They are looking dead. We need to see more out of Betray Esports. And looks like they are going to uh, six pick to Tachanka. I'm going to see a little confidence over in five here. I think they can just walk all over Betray. Which it looks like that is the case here. No, don't mean to hurt any Betray fans out there, but like, come on. Look at the scoreboard. Look at how they're playing, it just doesn't look like they're there. It doesn't look like they're ready to play. Ooh. 
shoots the bandit pretty low. Is he gonna dock him? Nope. He said screw bandit. It's like we are gonna see a front door push. Chaka is on his turret. <laughs> if Chaka gets a kill, folks, that's just gonna be the kill of the game because, like, that is a Tachanka. Has to be the Tachanka turret, though. BC is already in Hookah side. Everybody is first floor, though, for the defenders. Pusher, the Ash trade shots with the Legion. Locket is very low. Peeking the drone hole. Nobody is at the drone hole, so that is. This is a very good peek to do. A Vizzy is in courtyard. As the Jaeger, he is going to try to go a frag and an operator. He's been playing mostly support this uh, whole best of three matchup. Oh, down goes by Rise. 4v4 situation here for the attackers. Betray Esports picks off that Roamer. Wiener is up soft. So is Rush and IQ. They do have top control. Nomad is going to rotate down to the kitchen. Nope, he's going to go right back upstairs. Snake Killer picks off the IQ. He is one health. I wonder if he's going to go get a stem pistol from that dock. Yep, dock does uh, dock the lesion. Ledge dropped courtyard. Picks off. May rush. Sledge is down. Well done by Miller. Pulling down Sunrise. 4v3. Pushing into Sunrise right now. Is that. I believe that's the Ash. Yes, that is the Ash. Picks off the Ash. Well done by Miller. 2v4. We have the Habana and the Nomad left. They need to make a play here. It is a 4v2. And Warfighter, wow, picks off a Pucks. He's playing very good. Oh, just sees the Legion, but the Legion trades him out. 3v1 now. Nomad is in Sunrise. Doc knows he's in there. Nomad downs the Doc. He's a Legion. Picks off the Doc. And Legion trades him out. Well done by five. Don't know what Betray Esports doing here, but they need to change something. They need a new game plan. Because whatever they're doing right now, it is not working for him. Gonna see them go penthouse. This, I believe this is their last defense hole. No, I think there's. Uh, not sure. They changed the whole ESL rules of when they rotate and there's an extra round. I believe it's after this round. Do you see a Vizzy on that Maestro? He is going to anchor down again. That's what he does best. That's actually an interesting bell cam. So, 
Let's see what uh, Betray does here. They do need to, they need to come alive here. They need to, like there goes their top fragger. There goes all their energy. Killer Miller picks off Warfighter. That was Betray's top fragger here. Knows the IQ is pushing Pook aside. Doesn't want to give away his position, so does not return the fire. Also, is playing on that window. Knows the twitch is on it. Rotates away, gets the drone. Oh wow, rush with the quick pick on Rapunzel there. Pushes in. He's on the window. Their hard breacher is down. Wow, Snake Killer picks off that switch off the window. Rush trades him. Legion is down. 3v3 situation here. Valkyrie pushes in. Takes off IQ. Valkyrie is very low. Doc sees the Thatcher. Doc is down. Wiener picks him up. 2v1 now. Bomb is going down. Maestro is the last defender. Takes off Thatcher. No Thatcher's down. No Mag sticks the plant. I don't know if she's going to try to jump out the window. I think that's what he is waiting for. He physically can clutch this. This is very clutchable. He knows he's in the corner. He doesn't know he's making a rotator. He won't be able to go through that. Nope. Sorry, a busy. Not today. And he's still gonna try to make the rotator. He's killing a lot of time here. And then he gets nomaded. Wow. That should be uh, the top fail of this fucking league right now. That play by a busy there. Wow, that is, uh, that's a shame. Sometimes it'd be like that. Yes, this will be the last attacking round for Betray, as they do win that by a blooper by a Vizzy there. Well done, a Vizzy, for that. And that is right, Atomic. You can't lose four rounds attacking Coastline and expect to win all defenses. That is totally correct because this is an attack oriented map. And AVZ, you made the play of the game. Last round, definitely play of the game, 100%. And you're the talk of the talk of the stream now, even if you look what you did. So we are gonna see them do <laughs> retry that penthouse and theater hold. We got the IQ, the Ash, the Habana, Thatcher, and Nomad. Maestro, Doc, Jaeger, Echo and Legion. <laughs> If we could pull up the scoreboard here, that'd be great here. 7 4 4 1 1. Yeah, so it looks like Betray is coming alive, some of their players. Looks like Killer Miller's gonna go for another spawn peak here, try to pick off a player or two. Nobody spawns pool. Oh, we got one on pool, actually. Let's see if they get an interaction here. I think Beastly knows he's peeking it. Oh, Balake picks off Snake Killer. Well done by Balake there. That is one of their top fraggers. Ready. 
Looks like they are gonna do a VIP push with that Habana and that Thatcher. They just need to get control of the, the hallway there to even think of getting in there. So let's see what they can get in there. Looks like they're taking control of VIP. The Thatcher is in Hall of Fame. Their Nomad is on the hatch. Breaks the barbed wire. Gonna push into sight here. Locke is on that window. Oh, down goes Brush. A Vizzy with the quick frag. Nice pick by A Vizzy there. That is a very automized show cam, if I may say. Nomad. Oh, air jab goes off on the run out. Oh, there was two people on the repel there. Down goes Nomad. Miller picks off him. Well done by the killer Miller. He's playing exceptionally well. Here, let's see what we got here. We got the Ash holding the angle. There's 40 seconds left. They gotta do something. They can't be sitting around. 2v4? Nope. 2v3. Dagger's very low. Warfighter does get echoed. One v two situation here. BC sees the echo, trades out some shots. Or the dock, sorry. Oh, takes down the dock. Oh, wow, well done by five. As they go up a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. We got Bandit, the Smoke, the Vigil, or sorry, the Valkyrie, the Dock, and the Jaeger. We got Blackbeard, Nomad, Ash, Sophia, and the Habana on a Vizzy. Got Warfighter carrying his team by quite a bit here. It's not looking good for uh, Betray Esports because this map, again, is a very, 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 very attack oriented map. Like, there is no other map that is this attack oriented. This is going to be a tough defense, especially with that Blackbeard on the window, which I don't know why none of the attackers last round on Betray brought that Blackbeard. Blackbeard on the window is the most annoying thing in the world. Same with the Nomad, because Nomad can watch you run out. Even repelling on the service entrance door, like, there's so much you can do with the Blackbeard on coastline. This is literally Blackbeard's map. is gonna go for a spawn peek on that service entrance door. Smoke is playing behind the console desk. The main lobby. Blackbird is running that DMR. Sledge sees the Jaeger, knows he's in there. Oh. Beastly West picks off by Rice. Down goes the Sledge. Well done by Beastly there. Avoiding that flash spinning, then pushing out on by Rise. Warfighter takes out Killer Miller. 
Oh, Snake Killer jumps into sight, trades shots with the Valkyrie. Valkyrie is on the service floor. Rotates back out, jumps out the window. Wiener takes out Rapuxo 4v2 now, as the defenders are winning this round. We have the Havana and the Ash. Havana is full, Ash is 50. Smoke is watching that service window. Oh, takes off I may rush. 3v2 situation here now. He still thinks the Valkyrie's in bathroom, which she is. Valkyrie just holding down bathroom. Bomb is going down. Oh, Jaeger. The doc takes out a busy. Well done by the doc there, Balake. They're just playing it safe. They know the bomb is down. Takes out the doc. Snake Killer's got two left to kill here. A whole close to a minute left on the clock. He's gonna put that bomb down. Is he gonna stick it? And he stops to plant with one second left. He's got 35 seconds left. They're just waiting for him to plant the bomb, I believe. I don't think. Sees the Valk. Well done by Wiener there. Rotating from the bathroom all the way over into the service entrance hallway. Well played. We got Wiener, BC, Warfighter, Balake, and I may rush as Betray Esports again. And then Fi just dominating them in any aspect of this game, but they did lose that attack map down in Kitchen. We are going to see them hold a hookah and a billiards hold. They don't really have the select ops for a hookah hold, it looks like. We got Warfighter top fragging, 9-7, and then we got Killer Miller top fragging, 9-5. Well done by those two. Curious on what kind of attack push they're gonna do here. We do see the Zofia pushing up, and it looks like she's gonna do a VIP take. This is a very slow push. Well done by Warfighter taking off Snake. Oh, Warfighter picks off by rise 4v3 situation. Well done by Warfighter. Warfighters have a very, very consistent, well around game. Which drone, the lock A, has been called out. Warfighter is low, he has no more stun pistols, they all have been used. Which is in sight, oh, takes off Warfighter, Rapoxel. 
Oh, smoke. Well done by the smoke there. Oh, A Vizzy is repelled upside down. It's the upside down killer. A Vizzy jumps into sight 2v1 here. Bandit's pretty good on health. It takes off A Vizzy. Bandit is full health, while A Vizzy is literally like one health. He will die by a goo if he hits one. Oh my god, he sees the bandit. Well done by a busy. Oh my lord. That is the most luckiest thing I have ever seen in my life. Scoreboard 11 for Warfighter. Well done by Warfighter. This is match point. Fide will take the best of three match against Betray here. Can they close it out? Avis, he had a very well, well oriented clutch there. Well done by him. Recover for that terrible Maestro play that he did on uh, defense. Got Snake on the Montang, Repux on the Sledge, Virus on the Ash, Killer Miller 10 on the Zofia, and then A Vizzy on the Maverick. Legion is Wiener, Beastly is Jaeger. So, we got Yaquaza versus Distant. I'm very excited to cast that game. That game should be a very well fought game, very even match. Fight is the top team in this tournament. I believe in the power rankings, it's Fight is the top and Betray is at the bottom, which doesn't mean nothing. It is the power rankings, that's just predictions. But as you can see, Fight is one of the top teams in this tournament. I may rush picks off by Rice. We'll pick by Rush the Village, one of their good fraggers. Oh, and wants to peek a little bit too much. Boxel trades up smoke. I don't know why they have a smoke Roman, anyways, but. Gotta make something happen, right? They're gonna do a kitchen push here with the Montang. Montang and the Sledge pushing into kitchen. Looks like they're gonna do cool vibe take. Montang shoots that goo off. He pushes up cool vibe. Oh, Wiener takes off Snake Killer. Wiener takes a little bit of damage there, not too much. Burn in the ADSs. Oh, coming up on the flank. Repuxel turns on Warfighter. Oh, done. Repuxel turns on the lock A. 3v1 situation here. Well played by Repuxel. Oh my goodness, he's playing on a whole nother level. And the lock A leaves the game. Wasn't Marashley is not very good sportsmanship by Betray Esports there by leaving without saying their GGs. Well done by Fide there, so. We're gonna see Fi take this 2-0, and then another 7-2. Repuxel is the MVP, just like he was last game. Looks like he is going to get that uh, Ragnar badge. So guys, um, again, this is powered by Rogue Energy and Razor, and we got Tournament. We want to thank them for hosting our league. And all our sponsors, thank you. And all our viewers, thank you for tuning in. We will be back at 5 p.m. to host the Quasi.